Hey, good morning everybody and welcome to the vlog. I hope the start of your day is absolutely incredible. Of course, I'm going in Drogo's enclosure that is a, truly a jungle gym. We keep adding more stuff for it to climb on and it is definitely is getting very used to it. There's no doubt about that. It's amazing, this animal here. Drogo, good morning, buddy. What are you doing? He is so absolutely adorable. How you doing, buddy? You okay today? Well, guess what? I tell you what keeping a sloth now for the last few weeks, we've learned a lot about it, right? And a sloth is as close to a reptile as you can get with a mammal in a way, right? Because they don't regulate their body temperature. They need enclosures that are about the same as most reptiles, right? Maybe a, a 85 degree hot spot, a, a lower 80, upper 70s cool spot. They need about 60 to 70 percent humidity. Uh, we give them lots and lots of climbing room because again, a very intelligent need enrichment. And what we do is every couple weeks we've been switching around all of the ropes and stuff like that in here. And trust me, at night, this guy goes crazy. what I am gonna one day do a live cam in here so you guys can watch it because it's addictive I sometimes I'm like two o'clock in the morning sitting in my bed just watching Drogo cruise around but the one thing that you may not know about these guys is that they only poop about every four to seven days and pee and they crawl down to the ground to do it now when they do that sometimes I'll be honest with you it gets on their fur a little bit so you do have to wash these guys you can give them a shower a bath well we're gonna today try to give Drogo a bath. That's right, for the very first time, we're gonna give him a bath. Now, sloths do like water. We don't know if Drogo does. His previous owner used to give him a shower usually every couple weeks. Uh, so this will be the first bath. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know if it's gonna go smooth, not smooth. I'm not sure. So what do you say we just get ready uh, and give this a shot, right? What possibly could go wrong, right? So uh, this should be pretty fun. So Jay, of course, is like the head sloth keeper, right? So you think this is gonna go okay? Yeah, I think it's gonna go great. Do you really Fantastic. think so? Yeah. Really? So the idea is, is that we're gonna fill this up with uh, kind of warm water, right? Because they don't regulate their temperature. Right. Well, it'd be too hot, but it might be kind of whatever. And uh, it's gonna, this is gonna have soap, soap in it. Soap and water. Soap and water yep. in this one, so kind of like a bubbly bath, you know what I mean? And then we're going to have this is the rinse with just water, right? Yeah. And then the other thing that you guys may not know is that uh, they need to have their claws clipped, right? Yep. Well, good thing that Jay also grooms dogs and cats. Well, just cats or dogs? No, just dogs. Just no dogs. Cats. No, no, no cats. cats. <laughs> okay. Have you ever groomed a sloth? No. So, okay. So first time for everything. What could possibly go wrong? So we're going to go ahead and fill these guys up with lukewarm water. Uh, some suds here, clean there. Uh, we've got a little dryer that you brought from your place, right? Yeah, really and uh, we've got clippers and all kinds of stuff. So yeah, we're gonna, we're, we're Jay, we got this, it's gonna go great. We're about to give a sloth a bath. Oh my God, this is gonna be exciting. <laughs> You guys may remember that this hose actually comes out at about 84 degrees water, which is about where we want it to be. So we're gonna fill this up about, what, about a foot or so? Yeah, maybe about a foot and a half or so. Okay, and then you're gonna put some bubbly in there? Yep. What do we got? Puppy. Puppy with oatmeal. Puppy with oatmeal powder, mild powder scent. Oh, these guys smell so good. I smell that. Mmm, that smells good. I can't wait till Drogo smells like that. I would say that if he's gonna swim, He's gonna just swim like, like that. that dog yeah. Path, so. yeah. yeah. Well, I'm going with the backstroke idea. You think? You think? I, so Anthony's arms are gonna, gonna do go backstroke. Like, I think he's gonna backstroke. No, no way. No, no way. I think. I think one of a couple things is gonna happen. Either he's gonna sit still. Yep. He's gonna try to fight the heck out of us. Well, that's definitely gonna happen. Yeah, or he's gonna try to swim around. Yeah. I think I think one of those three things is gonna happen. Yep. Or maybe all two. three of them. <laughs> yeah, all three of them. <laughs> it's possible. So uh, definitely uh, first time. But if it does goes well, that'll be pretty awesome. Yeah, it'll be good. Because again, you know, it's not like they stink bad, but there definitely is a smell. I mean, yeah. there's no doubt that you know it, there's an, a mammal smell. So he's gonna have to get bathed at least once a once month a or month. so. Yeah, something like that. So so we're just gonna fill this up and. Uh, 
we're gonna get Lori over because I think that we should let Lori do it. We should just have uh, yeah, Lori do the whole thing. We should just let Lori do everything. Honestly. Yeah. What do you guys think? That'll be great. Yeah. <laughs> I, she, she would toss Drogo through the front yeah. window. <laughs> Drogo would go flying across. The thing. <laughs> so Drogo bathing day is awesome. Remember, guys, coming up here the day after Thanksgiving, Black Friday at midnight on Thursday night. So 12 a.m. on Friday, Black Friday at BHB starts. So make sure to go to bhbreptiles.com again midnight to midnight on Friday. Every single animal is on sale. So if you're looking for something, go check it out. You're definitely going to get something good. A great deal on stuff. Again, bhbreptiles.com Black Friday sale. Lori, predictions. <laughs> uh, predictions. Somebody's getting bit. <laughs> you think someone's going to get bit? Uh, high probability. Well, what stay out think? the bite zone. Then. What do you think? I will. Uh, I think you're going to give the sloth a bat. Okay. I mean, okay. maybe he'll love it. Maybe he'll just be like, yay. Oh, well, the backstroke. She's the back backstroke or front stroke? Back. So you think he's going to swim like this or swim like... Oh, I don't think he's going to swim at all. I think he's going to be like, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> let's, get, let's get Drogo and let's get over. Let's do this, Jay. Drogo, guess what? It's your big day. It's bath time. So he's really good about coming down, like you know, especially when he's in his hammock and stuff like that. Coming down is no problem. It's when we get in the bath that might be a little bit of an issue. So, uh, so we'll get his little uh, blankie that he's good about. Come on, drugs. Oh, by the way, I gotta tell you guys, we have some merch coming out in the next week that's gonna be Drogo Christmas merch. So you guys definitely gonna wanna wait for that. It's a little preview. Uh, you guys are gonna love it. Come on, drugs. There you go, Drogo. There's my Drogo. Good job. All right, good job, bud. And here we go. Oh my goodness, so what now? So what do you think? What do you, what do you think we should do? Just go for it or what? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Guess what, Drogo? You're about to get bath time. Come on, buddy. I just said baptize. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he's gonna get bath. Oh, he does not like it. He does not like the water so far. What Come on, Drogo. Come on, I'm gonna get this side. Come on, buddy. Come on, bud. Okay. Up, baby. There you go, baby. Okay, water time. He's actually not doing bad. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> he's, doing, he's doing the back. He's Call doing it. the backstroke. Call it. There you go, Drogo. <laughs> You're gonna smell so good, buddy. Was he stinking before? Yeah, he's yes. got a little odor to him, but not too bad. But he's doing really, he's actually doing better than I thought he was going to do, to be honest with you. Yeah, he's not making any noises or nothing. He's not going crazy. You know, I mean, I can even get his head and everything. Mm -hmm. No, we think we're going to do no water. There you go, buddy. You're doing so good. I took, Jay, this is going yeah, it's actually so, going great. this is going so much better. Uh, take a look at my camera. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you think? Think it's going good, Tori? Cool. Yeah, great. I'm actually shocked. You're gonna smell so good, and you're gonna be so good. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> I know, like, yeah, what is that? <laughs> we thought he looked weird before. <laughs> Look at him, Look at this. this is great. He's like, I'm not in the water anymore. You can't make me see it. Look at how cute he looks. Look at how cute he looks, oh my gosh. You look so cute. Oh. He's like, oh yeah, you guys think this is funny? <laughs> Let me give me that hand. I'm gonna bite you. Good job, Drogo. You're doing so good, buddy boy. I know. You're doing good. I tell you guys, seriously, this is going so much better, and he's gonna smell so good when he's done. And he doesn't seem to be like freaking out at all. He's just very methodical. There you go, buddy. Oh my gosh. He's so cute with suds on, isn't he? <laughs> As a dog groomer, how's this going? Um, it's going better than most dogs. It's like an old man just hanging out yeah, in the bath, in the you know bath. what I mean? Like, hey, what's going on now? Suds me up. I think that's good. Okay. You want to go to the next thing? Yeah, I was thinking that you were going to do the transfer of this one. Oh, uh, no, Laura's doing it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here. Hold the camera. Come on, buddy. Uh-oh. Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> now, now it's going to be true. There you go. Good boy. All right, so now we just need to rinse him down. Obviously, we want to get all the soap off him. Good job, drugs. You're doing good, buddy. Whoop, hang on, buddy. It's okay, baby boy. It's okay. It's okay. I'm right here. I'm right here. There you go, Drogo. He smells so much better. Hi. Whoa! Whoa! Crazy arms. It's okay, Drogo. Okay. 
right. Drogo's not happy right he now. He doesn't like this part. <laughs> he, he was much happier in the soap. It's okay, Drogo, it's okay. Nope, it's okay. It's okay, buddy. It's all right. We're almost done. You just got to get a little bit more soap on you. Soap? <laughs> I mean, you got to get a little more that soap off, baby boy. Come on. Come yeah, on. Hold him like that. Here you go. Oh, it's easy for you to say, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, head a little bit too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, he's got the he's got <laughs> Yeah, I got it, Brian. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! He needs something else to hold on to. There you go, Joe. There you go, okay. Brian. Here, Joe, Joe, Joe. <laughs> almost done. Oh my god, he is so upset. I know, he's holding on to He's trying to get your face softly. There you then go, go Joe. Go. I think that's good. Okay, now we just need to dry you off, buddy boy. The actual part of soaping them up went really, really well. This part he didn't like, which is interesting because the previous owner used to shower him all the time. So I thought that he would like the shower, but apparently he doesn't. So we're just gonna try to dry him off a little bit with a towel and then we'll just gently blow dry him and see how that goes. Just kind of getting him a little bit dry the best we can. Okay, buddy. It's okay, okay, Drogo. It's okay, buddy. We're right here, it's almost over. I know, it's okay, Drogo. Drogo, it's okay. So I think Drogo's just about done with this for sure. Here, you take this, Lori. Just one last little bit, and then, then we're all done. She does not like that. She said he likes it. She lied. Yeah. <laughs> the good thing about this is I can stand all the way back here and still dry. So definitely, he doesn't like this part at all, but he does need to get a little dry. He can dry the majority on his own, but you have to be, you know, this is just something that we have to do to him, unfortunately. Uh, overall, I think he did very well. Definitely not enjoying the blow dry part. There's no doubt about that, but we're almost done. We'll get him back in his enclosure. He'll settle down in no time and uh, he'll be completely fine. Okay, we're learning this thing and we're gonna have to learn how to do this the best for the least amount of stress for him and uh, the least amount of danger for us because he's definitely not happy and he would bite us right now if we give him the opportunity. But we're almost done, we can get him back and uh, that would be our first experience with bathing a swamp. And then the last thing we need to do is that their nails do need to be clipped just like a dog, right? So it's important to do it. So we're gonna just try to do this as easily as we can. I'll try to distract him a little bit over here while Jay tries to actually get a little claw here. That's okay, Drogo. Oop, there you go, we got one. I think what we're gonna do is just wait on the nails because you know he just looks like he's getting a little bit too stressed out. So we're gonna go ahead and get him back in his enclosure. We're all done, Drogo. I know, you are so upset, I understand that. I get it, baby, but you're gonna be okay. He smells so good though compared to what he did. There's no doubt about it. All right, Drogo, we're back home. We did good, buddy. Good job, bud. Good job, bud, Drogs. There you go. Good job, bud. I'm not gonna lie. That was probably more stressful for us than it was for him, to oh, be definitely. totally honest with you. Because, you know, this is the first time we've ever done it, and you don't want the animal to get stressed out and stuff like that. And you can see he's back to kind of crawling around. He's going to be fine. He'll be dried. It's nice and warm in here, obviously. In the next couple hours, he'll be completely fine. But, wow, uh, what an experience. My heart rate is up. I've done a lot of crazy things with king cobras and mambas and, and giant snakes. And I don't think I've ever been more nervous about working with an animal, but all in all, I think it's doing good. And look at now he's eating right off the bat. Which he is great. Yep, which is great. That tells you, you know, he's not that stressed out. If you went right back, that's his treat. And again, we want to reward him at the end because although it was kind of a traumatic experience for him, like, oh my gosh, I'm getting bathed and stuff like that. Now we give him a reward, like, good job, Drogo. And he'll remember that, right? At the end, like, if I do that again, I get a treat at the end. And he loves sweet potatoes. So, Drogo, you did absolutely amazing. Good job, Jay. Good job. And there it is, bathing a sloth, guys. Absolutely amazing. Uh, I cannot tell you how much I love Drogo. He is absolutely incredible. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna start an entire playlist of Drogo right over here. You can check that out. You can just get your fix of Drogo if you want. Again, I told you that merch is coming soon. That'll be dropping hopefully in the next couple days. Up here, you can subscribe to my podcast channel called Checking In. On this side, I hope that you're subscribed to this vlog channel. If you're not, please hit that subscribe button. Turn the post notifications on. Have an absolutely wonderful day. Remember, be kind to someone, and I promise I'll see you tomorrow.